another episode of In Meg's Head with me, Meg. So today I am finally giving you the video that I said would be out weeks ago. Yes, that's right. It's Drunk Meg on Schoolies. So before I get into it, I should probably give some context. So Luke and myself went on like a couple's getaway, nice peaceful weekend to Phillip Island. Little did we know, our cute peaceful weekend was about to be flipped upside down by a bunch of drunk 18 year olds on a belated schoolies. <laughs> so forewarning for this video, I did do something uh, pretty stupid. I drank while taking my medication. Please, please, please do not do this. It's really stupid and not cool at all. Probably shouldn't have done it at like, if, yeah, it was a dumb idea, but it just so happened to make for a, a pretty hilarious video. All right, I haven't been drunk in, I haven't been drunk in months. Like it hasn't been, it's been a long time. Not only that, I've never been to schoolies. And for the first time, I want schoolies. This is funny and all, but why the fuck am I here? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so in this case, Drunk Meg got it right. Uh, I actually had have never been technically on schoolies. When I finished year 12, like many musical theatre students, I went straight into auditions for schools. Like, I was just so focused and I just completely missed it. I didn't have a chance to go back, redo it, anything like that. And then I also didn't want to be a tallies, so... I kind of broke that one. <laughs> oh no, I'm already filming. I didn't even realize. <laughs> Look, I feel like most of this video is me just not knowing that I'm filming. <laughs> Two weeks. <laughs> no! I'm sorry. I don't know. Stop it. Stop it. Oh. By the way, I'm not talking to anyone. I'm just talking to myself watching this. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Wow, Luke, you really know you're drunk when you have to apologize to your future self. <laughs> so, Hi. I have a few friends. Um, I'm incredibly drunk right now. <laughs> but, you know what? That's okay. <laughs> it is. That's okay. <laughs> We're allowed to be drunk sometimes. We're toys. <laughs> That's okay. I'm on incredible, like, lots of medication. <laughs> oh my god, I love reviewing myself drunk. I literally just outed myself for being drunk on medications in front of like a bunch of 18 year olds. And not only this, but I had and have no fucking idea who those girls are. I'm sure they're lovely, but I would really like to know who they are. I need to pee! I need to pee so bad! I need to pee so bad and Luke's taking me because I need to pee so bad. I want to do this more often! Woo! I got, I got friends! I'm making friends! I feel like I had more people around me than Luke purely because I was just complimenting them all and they liked that like I was just being nice to them and they were like this girl gets it this girl is nice we like her I made so many friends I can't remember their names what I wouldn't call that a friend no but they're real friends because they helped me Will you, will you remember them tomorrow? Yeah, because they said that if I go in the girls' toilets, then I'll be machete. This is not a good idea. This is a great idea. All right, okay. I feel like I should explain this one. So when some people get drunk, they get really sad or angry or like really happy. When I get drunk, <laughs> I just get like super friendly and caring to everyone. Even the people that you probably shouldn't be friends with. Anyway, so after I met all these people, some of the girls came up to me and they were like, hey, you should be careful going into the girls' toilets uh, because there's guys in there with machetes. And so apparently on this schoolies, they had a couple of gangs there. And literally the night before, a guy in the group that we were kind of hanging out with was bashed so badly by one of these gangs that he had to be airlifted to the Royal Melbourne. So these guys were not fucking around, right? Which probably should have deterred me from going into the girls' toilets, but hey, when a girl's gonna go, she's gonna go. 
knowing me, I'd probably end up making friends with them and then becoming like a part of their gang by accident. <laughs> what doesn't help the situation? Repeating what I'm saying. What are you repeating? Oh boy. Oh boy. <gasps> oh boy. <laughs> Classy. What the fuck is with these 18 year olds? Honestly, it's, it's wild. Well put, Meg. Look, okay, although I can't remember much of that night, I have to say, Schoolies is freaking awesome, and I totally regret not going on it. If you're a year 12, and you don't want to go on schoolies, that's totally fine because it's up to you. But look, I feel like I missed out on like a milestone. That sounds so weird because it's schoolies and not riding a bike, but I highly recommend going on schoolies, even if it's just for like one or two nights because I get how social anxiety can really like stop you from doing that. But I really, really highly recommend doing something with your friends or just, you know, doing something like with a friend, going out for a weekend, doing something that you can kind of like remember um, and take into the rest of your life. Thank you so much for watching this video. I do have some new stuff in the works and I'm really sorry that this video has taken so long to get out. I've just been battling with some health issues, but I am making a real effort to just get content out there, show you kind of how, what I have to deal with and my struggles and whatnot um, in like a fun, comedic way. It's really hard mix, really, really hard mix. So thank you so much for supporting me. Thank you for watching this video. I would really appreciate it if you'd go and like the video, subscribe to my channel and comment on the video. Is that all of the things? Yes. I think that's all the things. Woohoo! Alright, thank you so much. Love you guys. Goodbye!